Turbo Conquering Mega Eagle, Ash and James here. Uh, <clears throat> after our recent experiments, uh, as you can see on a previous video, uh, casting a plaster head and incorporating uh, paper pulp into the mixture, we have decided to perform a highly scientific experiment. Um, altering the, uh, the ratio of paper to plaster mix. <clears throat> this will be a controlled experiment um, whereby we will cast a number of hands and destructively test the hands once they are dried. <laughs> that one's still wet by the way. Nice finger man. This is going to give me the finger. Uh, okay. Uh, so yeah, we're going to measure it all out and um, Excellent. Put it in the gloves, leave it a few days, and then break all things off. Yes. <laughs> As you can see, Ash is absolutely full of science today. Uh, measuring out five grams in that cup of shredded paper, ten grams in that cup. 20 grams in that cup. Uh, that one, zero grams in that cup. Uh, a couple more. We're between a 30 and a 40. Um, we have a control amount of plaster, so we'll be putting 550 grams of plaster in every glove, along with these. First one, we're going to use zero grams of paper. Put it in our mixing pot. Control 550 grams of plaster. And two cups of water. Three cups of water. Three cups of water. Three cups of water? Three cups of water. Three cups of water. Three cups of water. So that's the super mixing device. We just need the fingers to test it, so um, that'll be fine. Um, <clears throat> the final final mix: uh, 40 grams of paper, uh, 550 grams of plaster. In goes the papier. Few days and uh, and uh, 
then test them when they're dry. All right. Hands. <laughs> <laughs> Our hands are now dry. Um, the 40 grams of paper hand seems to be retaining moisture quite a lot. As you can see here, it's still quite wet, so it's probably going to break quite soon, but uh, well, we'll see. Um, All science. <clears throat> science, hands, hands. Anyway, we're going we're gonna to start off by testing the zero paper content glass to hand. Uh, with a spring balance on the on the fingies and uh, measure the force required to snap a finger off. I have no idea what that read. I'm reliably insured this is known as the uh, what index finger? Yeah. Oh, two four, two six, two eight, three three, three two, four. Bit of bending. Four. Oh no. It's five kilos. Fracture at the base. We do have a problem, some of these fingers have picked up air pockets, so they'll be marked down in the results, fingers with air pockets, especially if they break at the air pocket. If we reinforce tests at five grams of paper, hit it ash. Um, the thumb, on the other hand, just achieved uh, two kilo. This is interesting. Science. Um, we've run into a bit of a problem. Our, our balance doesn't go up high enough, so it stops um, at six kilos. Um, so we've rigged up uh, a double or a half. Is it a double or a half? I don't know. One or the other. Um, just to prove that it works, we've got a axle here. On the double it weighs, or the halfer, double the halfer, uh, possibly 500 grams, and straight on the balance, we are yeah. perfectly accurate, but 900, um, yeah, it'll probably be more accurate at high readings, so we'll carry on with this, this is the best we can do at the minute, but basically the uh, 10 grams of paper, um, the same amount of plaster, uh, are far exceeding the, the figures of the pure plaster. Even even when we had an air pocket in one of the fingers, which we've noted, um, it's just got up to, to just one kilo less, and that's quite a significant amount of material missing there, and it's where, where the, the fracture happened. So we'll, we'll carry on like this and see if we can um, just make up some bullshit to fucking cover our findings, I suppose. Thank you. Bye. Then it's not needs more. It's too much friction here. Find me some string then. It's, it's okay. not not enough. Hands. <laughs> Science. Why is your light on? I don't know. It keeps switching itself on. So the hands are. Uh, it's been scrupulously tested to uh, ascertain uh, the breaking strain of each finger in mix with hands. <laughs> and uh, from our results, the uh, 10, 10 grams of paper per 550 grams of uh, plaster is the best. Which is 2% paper with the plaster mix. And it should be added that this plaster mix was sloppy enough to pour uh, and as such anything over 10 had too much water retention to get sensible figures. Um, so it is, it is also possible that the, the higher quantities of paper would have uh, would be stronger however they take so bloody long to set that um, I don't really care. Um, either way this has been very interesting. Uh, have you found it interesting, Ashley? Yeah, this information. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me.
rescue me. <laughs> this information has been is very handy to know for our uh, experiments. Um, and I'm so glad that number 10 was hands down the best. Um, hands. <laughs> Science. Okay. Um, thanks. <laughs> we hope you found this information very useful. Um, We're going to do a... Uh, destructive test on the uh, <laughs> on the the, uh, the the palms and whatever's left now so um, yeah let's do it right let's destroy these palms um, some of you might not realize but Ashley's one of the most calibrated human beings known to mankind uh, and as such this is probably a more accurate way of testing these hands with a, a compressive destructive test than, uh, than, than any form of laboratory test, uh, also known as the human torque wrench. Uh, Ashley's aiming to hit each palm with approximately uh, 550 kilopascals of voltage and, uh, <laughs> and, thus, and thus accurately test uh, any differences in materials. Go for it, man. Right. Well, as there's going to be flying shards everywhere, we need to wear safety equipment. Right. Hmm. Uh huh. Very interesting. Hmm. Oh, hands down the winner. Definitely. Excellent. So um, this hasn't really shown us very much. Uh, Obviously, Ash's hammer blows were very consistent, um, and if you're ever going to try this at home, then without doubt, number ten is the best. Look how many fewer fragments that um, split into, like pretty much like um, all right, Kevlar plated, armor crusted, double glazing. Um, thanks for your time, Turbo Conquering Mega Eagle. Please like and subscribe and share and stuff. Bye.